Hello, this is Devin Lockett once again here at the Biometrics Health Center with another holistic health tip. Today we're going to be talking about black strap molasses. Molasses is made from uh, sugar cane. It's a byproduct of extracting sugar, I guess you could say, or it's a primary product from sugar cane. Blackstrap molasses is what comes from the third boil of sugar cane. It's a little bit different from the regular molasses that you find in the store. Um, I don't like really showing products, but I'm going to show you this plantation molasses. It's a little bit darker than regular molasses. It's kind of black. It's very dark. Uh, regular molasses is more brown in color and higher in sugar and lower in sodium. Blackstrap molasses is dark, very dark as you can see, and it's higher in sodium and lower in sugar. It has less sugar and more salt. It's got a, a got a good taste. It's got a, a taste, a, kind of a bittersweet taste. Um, but the thing about blackstrap molasses is that it's very high in um, copper, magnesium, manganese, um, calcium, potassium, yes, and it is great for skin and hair. I'm going to take this before I spill it all on my desk. Mm. And it's a good sweetener. It's a good sweetener for things like oatmeal or making cookies or cooking. But what most people take blackstrap molasses for is uh, for healthy hair growth, skin, and for turning gray hair back to its original color. Brown, uh, red, blonde, whatever color your hair was when you were younger. Um, I think it has to do with the high iron and copper content in it. The high copper content in blackstrap molasses is good for replenishing your melanin levels, so it helps to get your beautiful skin color back. And it's also, you know, melanin is also good for um, returning hair to its original color. It's also high in antioxidants, which is another factor for stimulating hair growth. The high iron content is good for anemics or for those who are suffering from uh, low iron or, you know, just maintaining good iron levels. Because it has a low glycemic index, it's, uh, it's good for diabetics and it's good for controlling blood sugar, even though it is a form of sugar. If you take a little bit every day, and I mean a little bit, like I just took, a, tea, a tablespoon, right? Just a little bit every day. Uh, it's good for hair growth. It's good for your skin. And it relieves such conditions as uh, chronic muscle tension. Blackstrap molasses is good for bone health because of the high content of iron, selenium, copper, and calcium, which also makes it good for fighting against osteoporosis. It has a lot of potassium, so it's good for heart health and controlling blood pressure. It has high levels of HDL cholesterol, also known as good cholesterol, which means it protects against heart disease and stroke. Like I said before, it's good for controlling your blood sugar levels if you eat it with carbs. I like to eat it on oatmeal and cereal. Because it has more antioxidants than honey or any other sweetener, it's good for uh, defending against oxidative stress, which is associated with cancer and other illnesses. It's also loaded with potassium. One tablespoonful, which is what I just had, is about equal to uh, half a banana as far as potassium is concerned. But most people just take blackstrap molasses every day to try to reverse gray hair or to help your hair grow. And, you know, I'm not mad at you because I take it for the same reasons. Well, believe it or not, that's all I have to say about blackstrap molasses. If you like this video, please remember to hit the like button, uh, comment, share, and subscribe to BiomedRx TV and to Devin Lockett TV. And if you would like to provide us some financial support, feel free to become a patron on our Patreon page. And remember, as always, I would like everyone to stay kind because kind is the new sexy. Stay blessed and stay healthy. Thank you for watching BiomedRx TV.